the Walnut Street Theatre is probably one of the most storied theatres in this country. It's been in continuous use for over 210 years, standing here at the corner of 9th and Walnut Streets. It is the anchor for most of the theatrical artists in this city. We're the most greatly subscribed nonprofit theater in the United States. We now present five shows on the main stage every season. We present five shows in our independence theater. We have a kids series. Altogether, we present to 360,000 people a year. We and our audiences bring about $29 million a year to the Philadelphia community. It's Bernard's vision that made that happen. What you see on the main stage is obviously an incredible part of what we do. But when you think about the educational programs and the reach out into this community, it's, it's enormous. We have probably the largest educational outreach of any theater in this country. Because of our educational outreach program, Walnut Street Theater has touched the lives of hundreds of thousands of children. In the Philadelphia School District, what we've seen over the years is unfortunately arts funding has been cut. And what we discovered is that there's a need, there's a gap, and the Walnut Street Theater has stepped in to fill it. The Walnut Street Theater has provided a venue and a mechanism to allow our children to be expressive and to learn about art. We are proud recipients of the partnerships that they do with schools through the adopted school models, through the community outreach models, through experiences that young people have, not just at the theater, but in their schools and in their communities. The two things that I think kids need the most are self-worth. We give them that when they learn that they can actually do things like stand up in front of a room and speak for themselves. But kids also need connection. And when we go into a classroom and teach them how an ensemble works, that one person is no more important than everybody else, which is what theater's all about, that's life-changing. When we engage with our young children and you see the magic and the spark that comes into their eyes, it elevates their lives, their passion, and their ability to learn. This work is an extraordinary privilege uh, to go in there and see that there's meaning in what you do. In the 35 years of the Walnut Education Program, we've never had a stronger relationship with the School District of Philadelphia. We do so much already, but we can do so much more. My dream would be that we're able to expand this so that more children and more schools have access to these types of opportunities. Every child that we reach benefits by what we do, so we can only get better by reaching more kids. The Wall Street Theater has been enormously successful it's been here for 210 years. But it won't be here for another 210 years if we stay in place and just do what we're doing now. There has to be a cultural life. It's the spark that keeps the community alive. Being the largest subscribed theater in the world is not enough. We have to be able to grow for the next generation. It's our responsibility as part of that community to continue to expand, to serve as many kids as we can. There isn't a space in this theater that we haven't filled. We need to grow. We always intended to expand our educational programs, expand our entertainment, and take more artistic risks. The theater to be vital has to be alive. Live theater offers an intangible that other art forms just don't bring to the audience. As an educational tool, really beyond compare. It is part and parcel of being a nonprofit theater, that you reach out and serve your community. And the best way to do that is take your program into the schools, bring the children into the theater, and be a vital part of that community. And for those reasons, we need to grow. And I'm especially excited about the prospects of our future.